Good morning. Have a great Wednesday, everybody. It looks like today's going to be very similar to yesterday. Probably bring those temperatures up a little bit uh, from what we saw yesterday, but all in all, the clouds are going to be hanging out with us, and we do have the threat for a couple of spotty light showers for the most part. Upper East Tennessee has the best chance of seeing some rain throughout the day today. Yesterday, we did top out at 73 degrees after a morning low of 57. The record was 98, so back in 1936. No records, obviously, there. Uh, the averages for this time of year are 86 and 65, so well below average. And officially at the airport, didn't pick up any rainfall. Allergy report uh, sent in by the Allergy, Asthma, and Sinus Center each day. Uh, trees, grass, and weeds are in the low category. Mold is in the moderate category. Still tracking this pesky upper level low that's throwing the clouds our way, keeping our temperatures on the, temperatures on the cool side. That is what's going to be with us again throughout the day today. And that's going to bring us increasing chances uh, for the clouds to hang around, also a chance for a couple of spotty showers. Here's your future cast. We'll take you from now through the afternoon hours. Uh, and again, uh, you'll have that northeasterly flow. Upper East Tennessee has the best chance and best coverage of rainfall. It weakens and dies down as it slides its way to the south and east. But there's some upper level energy that's going to swing its way on through. We just don't have a lot of potential energy, if you will, to tap into. And so we're not looking at a whole lot of activity. A little bit of a low level instability. I think it's really going to keep the clouds in place for the better part of the day, kind of like what we saw yesterday. Just didn't see a whole lot of sunshine. Uh, rainfall amounts, you can see clearly that not everyone's going to get the rain and not everyone's going to get uh, abundant rainfall. I just don't think that's going to be the case here throughout the day today. Uh, so your forecast by the lunch hour, we're going to see those temperatures uh, climbing into the upper 60s, low 70s, depending on when you take your lunch hour. Uh, really not a bad day ahead of us today. Again, similar to what we saw yesterday, but should be just a touch warmer. Highs will be in the mid to upper 70s and a nice evening ahead of us as well. Again, tonight, we're going to see those temps falling down into the low 70s by around 7 o'clock tonight. All right, overnight lows dip down into the upper 50s to low 60s. Tomorrow, much more of the same, a chance for a couple of uh, spotty showers and some thunderstorms. We're gradually increasing that coverage and chance for rain as we get into our Thursday and Friday time frame. We should dry out on Saturday. That's the first official day of summer. Can you believe it? And it's going to be definitely hotter as we get into the upcoming weekend and more humid as well. On Father's Day, about a 30% chance for some pop-up showers and thunderstorms, hot and humid, with cooler temperatures and increasing rain chances as we start next week. Have a wonderful and safe day.